Hi everyone, this is Aaron with Backwoods Guitar. In this video, we're going to go through a little bit of music theory, just so you don't end up learning how to play guitar by memorizing chord patterns and shapes. You'll actually know what you're playing and why. Let's go over to the whiteboard and get started. Okay, so let's get started. Music, much like cooking, everything's made with a recipe. So what we're going to start with is the recipe on how to make a major scale. Up at the top, I have already written out all the notes that there are. And the formula for making a major scale is in steps. Whole step, whole step, half step, whole, 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 half. Okay, and for example, the distance from B to C would be a half step. Distance from B to C sharp would be a whole step because it's made up of two half steps, okay? So let's do one. Let's do, let's write out a C scale because C has no sharps or flats, it's the easiest one. So let's start with C and use our recipe and see what we get. So we're gonna start with C, whole step, D. Whole step from D, E. Half step from E, F. Whole step from F, G. Whole step from G, A. This A is what starts over here, right? So we're here. Whole step A gives you B. And then half step from B puts you right back at C. Perfect. Okay? Let's do another one. Let's do the key of G. How about that? Let's do G and let's see what we get. Okay, where's G? We're going to start with G. Whole step from G gives you A. Whole step from A gives you B. Half step from B gives you C. Half step from C, or whole step from C gives you D. Whole step from D gives you E. Whole step from E gives you F sharp. And then half step from F sharp, right back at G. Pretty easy, right? So now let's learn another formula. How about a formula for a major chord? Its formula, instead of using steps, we're gonna use tones out of these scales we just wrote. And to do a major chord, we're gonna use the first, third, and fifth tones of these scales. So if I wanted to make a C major chord, the notes that are gonna make up that chord are gonna be the first one, which is C, the third tone, E, and fifth tone, G. Now what if we were, what are the notes in a G major chord? One is G, three, B, five, D. Pretty easy, let's do a different one. How about a minor chord? Minor chord is one flat third and five, which means we just flat the third tone of our scale. So if we were going to do a C minor chord, it would be C. The third flatted would be E flat and G for your fifth. G minor, G flat the third gives you B flat and D for your five. Now you know the theory about what it takes to make a major scale and major chords. Tune into our next video where we're gonna dive into the circle of fists and see how things really get interesting. 